and welcome back, everybody, to episode 10. Uh, today, we are going to be finishing up the Lunar Licensing Program, which does consist of the 6th one, the 5, which we need to go do, the, do some stuff on the moon so that we can get our required investors. Okay, so we... Yes, last video, we worked on the Tundra, so... That means, I guess, if we could, if we do technically need more of this, if we could do biocatalyst, we technically could. I mean, I'm not saying that's ideal, but we could technically do biocatalyst. Okay, how many officers? We need a thousand officers. Well, let's get some more officers. There we go. I don't remember what we need. Oh my word, we need so much power. And do we have enough fusion cells? What else do we need for fusion cells? We need a lot of stuff. Uh, okay, well, I mean, technically, I should just be able to put those two, and then that's the limit of that reactor. And I'm going to move this guy over along with this one. And a lot of things are going to go wrong here. But it, this is all fine. Just don't worry. Everything is perfectly fine. Perfectly fine. Yes, yes, yes. Very perfectly fine. Pause you. Okay, sector. Oh, okay, sector balance is fine. Okay, so let's then let's do this. So now we have that, and where's the anti-grav component? Did I not place down an anti-gravity component factor thing? No, I did not. Okay. Uh, okay, so, what do we need for anti-gravity components? Actually, first off, how many anti-gravity components do we need? We need 18 anti-gravity components. Oh, anti-gravity confiscators, not components, sorry. These need fusion cells? Oh, okay. Okay, uh, well, let's start off with this. Let's remove both of, all three of the power plants, solar power plants, to give us those mining spots. Now let's start getting some helium-3. I'll pop two helium-3 miners down. Um, probably then over here I'll pop a moon ice miner. Don't worry, our power problems are fine. They are all perfectly fine. Don't worry. We are fine. See? We're fine. We are perfectly, perfectly fine. Let's build a logistics depot, though. But we're going to need more logistics, so build another one. Okay. So now, with you... We need a lot of these things. And these are big. Really big. Okay. Okay, slide you over and slide you over there. Nice. Uh, we're going to need more fusion cells and more rare earth metals. Where do we get rare earth metals? Do we have a... You're a titanium mine. You're a creep harvester. You're a creep harvester. Here are two helium harvesters. Is this a helium or is that creep? That's creep helium. Moon ice. We need another. We need another whole mine. For moon ice. It's not moon ice. Uh, creep. Not creep. It's rare earth metals, but the things the thing is called a creep miner. I don't know. I call everything else by. I don't know. I don't know why I do that. Um, minus three to plus seven. There we go. We're all good. Okay, so now we need a transfer route of that. There to there. Yeah, just send all 22. Not like it's going to hurt us. What I am going to do is going to put another one of you down. And then I'm going to start maxing this guy out. Because I first, I mean, I love having extra energy. And I've put no modules on these. Okay, first off, I'm going to put finance calculators, not anything else, because 
we started the video with plus one hundred twenty three thousand dollars, and now we have plus ninety thousand. So, and only six hundred thousand dollars left in our stock. So, and people, those are easy. Money, that's another thing. There we go. That helps. And then let's get a few more people. Uh, by well, you provide how many? You provide forty four workforce, and you provide. 20 workforce. So it is beneficial to upgrade to officers. This will definitely, definitely help with all sorts of problems. Okay, so everything's good here. All good here. We need more rejuvenators. We need another rejuvenator. Bump you up to six. Um, okay. So we should be all we should be all good, all right? All 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 nice and clear and good and nice. Okay. Fusion power cells are at zero. We need them to be at plus twenty five, and there's we're missing a lot of uh that. So maybe we should go make. Okay, let's first get some money here. What's your market cap? Four point six. There we go. Back up to three mil. Uh, where's the rover? Where's our rover? Right there. Let's go claim this sec, this crater, so that we can. Where is it? So that we can make. Um, why don't why don't I look? Oh, so yeah, we should be making enough of these plates if we need to. So let's. Get a large shield generator out right there. And there's the mining site right there. Got our titanium mine. I think we have plenty of titanium. I don't remember though. It's, I mean, titanium is always nice to have though. So it, that decreases it because we don't have enough logistics. Let's max out you. You're maxed out. You're maxed out. Okay. How much of this do we make? Making 70. Well, clearly that's not enough. 230? And 130, I meant, sorry. Do we still make enough? No, we don't make enough of that. Well, whatever. So it's actually, how many more of these can we make? Is that it? No, we don't. Oh my word, that's not it. So let's actually... Move you to there. And then let's increase you further to 170. Holy moly, that's a lot of a. It's a lot of a. Plates. I'm just moving these to the back so that we can put. It. You know, there's probably a more efficient way of doing that, but. Symmetry. Boom. Done. Beautiful. And you make how much? 170 of those per minute. Let's pop out one of you. Pop out one of you. My 16. So we still need another miner. Okay. So. There we go. Okay. Now we have enough. Now we're making. A lot of those plates. Because these things are very expensive. And we need to make, I think, like plus 25. Actually, no, plus 26, because that's how many is needed for the spaceport. Okay. There we go. All nice and good. Helium 3 is fine. Moon Ice is fine. We're good. Okay. But we can put modules on you. What do you, what do you consume a lot of? People. What do you consume a lot of? People. I mean, it also does consume a lot of power, don't get me wrong, but we're on the moon. Remember that. And while we're on the moon, we can we can make a lot of power. Okay. Yeah. I think we're all good. So now let's hit back here and let's get back to work. 
setting up this. Can I, like, I wish I, the one thing I wish I could sell is I wish I could, like, sell energy. That would be, like, amazing. Tundra. How much, no, no, Lunar. How much does this stuff sell for? A thousand? So if I did 27 of those, if I, actually, if I just did 20, that'd make me $14,000. If I maxed out one of these, that'd make us $366,000. And what happens if I maxed out one of the selling bio answers? Four hundred eighty-seven. So we'll have to make bio answers eventually. Okay. So here's our current investors. Stadium is huge. Where where can I put it? Um, we could fit it in by ripping out. Like that section of people. Don't forget about the roads as well. And the trees. We'll figure this out. We can fit. We can fit this in. Don't worry. Let's move you. Um, and just demo you, I guess. Uh, not you. Kidding me? Did, did I just read that right? Does it say I need like two or three more? Nineteen. Ah. Uh, okay. Okay. I see. I mean, I get it, but okay. Ah. Uh, I don't know if I can fit another one in here. No. I have to, like, knock out the next row of people as well. And disconnect that. This is, like, super challenging to get this to all work. Yeah. Um, I mean, stadiums, these things are huge. We need so much... Stadium, like well, I don't know what you would call it, like influence, like I, I don't, I don't know what to call it, but like our people need to have a lot of access to this stadium, and uh, I don't know what I can do to help fix it. It's like, right, I just now have to figure out a way to fit this many more people in here, and now we're like low on logistics. This is going great. What Why are I was clicking on all the wrong tabs there? Okay, now we're low on logistics. Could we fit? What if we just move the kelp farm? That could help. Okay, so five thousand out people. Big houses. Upgrade all. Upgrade all. Upgrade all six of you. Now, let's first fix our uh, very apparent problems. Let's start with what are we low on? Intelware. Where do we make Intelware? Is this the Intelware fab? Yes. Yeah. Oh, dude, that's way too many. I'm not in the mood for overproduction right now. And can I remove that one? Yes. Now, microchips need more. Fax fibers need more. Well, it's actually, because we just got biocatalysts. Don't know how many we have. How much does this consume? Ten? We have one. I'll send more over. This should help plus twenty five. You make plus twelve, so I can rip you out entirely. Thirteen, you make fourteen. So it's I can rip you out. 
Another thing I can do is put those on juice plants, I believe. Yeah, those use 15 each. Okay. Well, let's let's go work on getting those hooked up and uh, supplied with biocatalysts. We up these ships yet to larger ships? No. D noting this, we need about a hundred more. Yep. Yep, this is uh this is what we do now. So we're minus like a hundred here, I believe. Yeah, and each one of these makes 33. Wait, a full one makes 44. I honestly don't know if I can do this. I mean, holy moly, look how many biocap. But it's getting harder and harder to do this every time. Okay, well, so if we run the road up, we could definitely fit in another... Another farm, another one there, another farm, uh, actually, or production plant, fab, whatever you want, whatever you wish to call it, to make more of these things. These wonderful things that solve a lot of issues. It's like the worst place to be building them, though. Okay. And uh, we now we need power. Actually, no, power's fine. Okay. How much are we down by? 45, so that means we need two more modules. Yippee. We need two entire production plants. Because you have to minimize that precise number. Now we need a bit more power. Okay, well, just a bit more power. And then do we need more methane? Or is it methane? Natural gas, sorry. Yeah, I know it's insufficient. There we go, that's all we need, right? And, well, and then people modules. And now we need moss. More moss. A lot more moss. I think that's the module limit. Yep. So that's just nice, convenient. Now my 24 moss. How much are we positive on that, technically? So uh, why did I hit space accidentally? How much are we down by? A lot. Let's do that. Let's make some more power. Minus 23, so that's That's that much. Uh, oh, okay, well, we still have enough moss. No, we need more of this. And I'm not going to right away put an uh, expansion on it for that because, like, we don't need it, so I'm not going to do it. And oh, okay, I get it. It's like a never-ending process of build more. Well, to build more, you need more of this. And are we good here? Yes, we're clear, clear, clear. Okay. So now we should have a bit more of that. Okay. 100%. Okay, now that we have a bit more of that, what I'm going to do is I'm going to put a biocast catalyst module on these three fully maxed out ones. I'm basically gonna, then going to go remove all the other ones that are anywhere to be found. So like, get rid of you, get rid of you, get rid of you. 
You have to view you and you. And now, let's see how much we're behind by. We're only by behind by like 107. Which means I can put another one of you down. With the biocatalyst funnel. Minus one. But we're minus five biocatalysts. Okay, now the other thing, now we don't need as much juice because I think it's only, yeah, yeah, it does, yeah, you don't, we don't nearly need as much juice, uh, for whatever you want or whatever you wish to call it. I mean, I could basically rip out this entire mod, that entire thing right there. Minus eight, sorry, whoops, everything but that. There we go. That just helped a lot with space and everything. So now, uh, oh, what's this? No. Um. Okay. So next step, we don't have a lot of iridium. Their vote. I can do when is this voting end? Twenty eight. So it's not quite the twenty eighth, so um so what we're gonna do we're gonna make a lot of people complain. We're probably gonna lose a lot of money. But once we build it, we will not be losing nearly as much of anything. Because corporate HQ and power is sort of now an uh, interesting problem. Let's jump that up to 20,000. There we go. And uh, I mean, I'm not going to go for extreme looks. Here because, well, although this doesn't provide that, we need more mobility, which you know does then require. Um, I mean, I should put at least should at least think about it. You know, put like an end cap on the ends. You know, do that stuff. But I say by I don't. I'm not gonna go crazy. Is uh. I'm going to have to put that there so I can move that, change that to one of these tier T modules, then put that there to then put another T module there, and then put another one there. Um, do those two. These are the garages, right? Plop that guy there. And then... Let's just... Wait, you cost 25. You cost 25.50. Okay, it doesn't matter. I just wanted to make sure that didn't, didn't matter which one. Now we're out of Iridium. Okay. Well, now you see what that was all about. Now, actually, no. Well, to fix this problem, let's go do this sector. What do you get on advanced here? 120? Well, 120 plus all the quests. Well, what ships do we got? Not the best. Let's do the two for now. Because, I mean, yeah, think about it. And which is the two that gives us iridium? So, we'll have to figure out a way to get that. I don't know. We'll look into that in a sec.
Okay, don't care about all your cutscenes. Actually, before we do anything. Okay. Okay, that's my iridium. Okay. That's not us. So let's go up. So we need four bombarders. Oh, we need a lot of missile barges this time, looks like. When I say a lot, I mean like six. So that one goes straight to Nick. Oh yeah, we have our tech, so it's like super powerful. So let's, yeah, let's head straight up there. Then straight, head straight over to there. We have one of the quests done. Oh, yay. Two missile barrages. Two of the five needed. Well, let's just boom that. Hit up there. Bombard that. I mean, we have to use a lot of missile barrages somehow, right? I mean, let's maybe go down there, get that one, and then come back up to see what those guys Or we can deal with them as well right now. I mean, they choose to attack us. It's their fault. They'll, they know they'll lose. Oh, just attack that. Whatever. Missile that big bow. Attack! Come, why are you ships not attacking? Oh my god. Like so wonderful EMP, you guys, because you guys are being so we can just work on these ships and not take a ton of damage. I mean, we'll still take damage, but now we'll have you. Oh, hey, we got the bombarder one. We have to use the Mr. Barrage two more times, so let's go attack that. Nice, thank you. What's down here? Uh, nothing of use. Come right there and attack that, actually. With the support fleet, we already have two of those, and we're about to get them down here, so it doesn't matter. Attack. Thank you. Two missile barrages. Well, we're going to save those for the eradicate. I mean, we're going to clear out that. Actually, go clear that. So I'm doing just clearing out everything. Actually, finding iridium storages would be ideal because we're doing this this for for iridium. Remember that. Attack these ships. I don't understand why sometimes these things don't always attack. And yes, we're going after the iridium storages. And yes, I know I don't have to constantly heal my ships, but. I don't know, I have nothing else to use my fuel on. That's uh, graphene, protochemicals, graphene, uh, iridium, so go attack that. Magnetite. Whoa, did we just lose a ship? No, that was our big boy ship that went through it, so we did not lose. All right, yeah, no lost ships. Missile. And missile again. Then double support fleet back. Okay, now let's go look. So I'm looking for a graphene sword. Not graphene, I read it. I'll come right there. So I search the area for more iridium storages. Don't see any more. So let's support fleet that, support fleet that. Um, support fleet those guys. I know I was saying I was going to save the missile barrages, but we're going to get a lot of missile barrages from this. So I'm not too worried. Charge in. 
EMP pulls two of them. Yes, got that. Just attack. Uh, attack one at a time, please, though. Attack the other one. Attack that one. <laughs> attack. To attack those. Then come over and attack these. Heal up on all those. And then come over and attack this. And this. And this. Okay, we're we're doing this. Okay, hey, we got a missile barrage. Nice. We're saving Matt for the Eradicator. More hunters. Okay. I mean, tight your loss. I mean, you guys have entire fleets, massive fleets of ships out here that I'm just plowing through. Let's just trying to clean up the map area, you know. We really, really want to keep them clean. And I mean, there's no more iridium storage that I've seen. That's a graphene. So we just have this region to go through. Now we're gonna have a lot of ships. Goal is to not try to have to use any of the sh things that we want to use on the eradicate. But you know, if worst comes to worst, we. We'll use support fleets and missile barrages. That's a ship that's about to die. I just noticed that. Hey, come on, get this dock. Get the dock. Kill the dock. Come on. There we go. Now kill this. Now go up and kill the big boy. And, I mean, there is an eradicator right there, but... It's also just an eradicator at this point. We can handle an eradicator, I'm pretty sure. You get specific fire one shot. One shot. That's all you need. We're about to get we're, there's another splash over this. We can we can we can use that. Okay, come on. Park right there. Now this is gonna be fun. Ha ha ha. We've got you now, eradicator. You kidding me? Oh, thank you. Hey guys, look, we got like a 33% return on our investment. We launched three missiles, we got two back. It's like free money. At this point. EMP it. I don't care at this point. Actually, yeah, EMP all this. We have so much extra supplies and it doesn't matter at this point so yeah, I haven't lost a ship yet it's nice Uh, let's head up here. So there's two missile barrages there, so we need to use once. I don't know. Blow up those guys. Is there another? There's. Oh, dude, this is just going to be a piece of cake. There's just missile barrages everywhere. Just, just dropped. 
the missiles. Boom, done. And there's two more right there. Look at that. Okay, how much iridium do we get? 282? Okay, that's pretty good. That's like that's a few modules. It's like 10 modules. I mean, to be fair, we got plenty of graphy. But yeah, so... Okay. Definitely want more modules, you know. We can supply the maintenance cost because it supplies all this. I mean, it takes up far less space, so. Well, let's look at this. So, if we rip out you, plop you up there. And also rip out you and that and that road. Not that big of a deal if you remove a road in that house. To now, then be able to remove these and then expanding them just a bit further. And then popping a cap on there and there and there. But we can't put those two caps on. So, well, there we go. We got the problem of uh, not enough mobility, I guess, would it be? Yeah. So there we go. We have the Lunar Licensing Program done. 0% access to entertainment. You don't provide, you provide 15 entertainment. Where? Why are there investors out over here? I don't care, actually. I'll just put more entertainment in. And where's the problem with mobility? Why? There's so many problems. So, what we're going to do is we're going to pop a stadium. And then to increase the effectiveness, we're going to put in a road. Then we're going to put this house there so that we can actually put a road from there to there, which actually doesn't really work. And we should be able to connect this somehow. Totally should be able, we can't connect this at all. Um, uh, well, let's just put the road in and uh, some people. Move that house up. Maybe we'll fit our person there. Put a house there. Uh, can fit pe can fit a person there. Move the end of that road. Uh, put people there and uh, there. See, nothing happened. Nothing at all. Looks exactly the same. Definitely. And we don't have enough mobility over here. Well, let's put a... No, we don't, because we don't have the stuff. These things are not small, either. Plenty of that, plenty of that. Uh, what do you want? No. Um, let's rip out that, then let's do this. Let's upgrade nine of you and nine of you. It should help. Hopefully. And now, no matter where I place that on the island, that should work. If, you, if I must. And then. You know, it's about time to start putting some trees in everywhere. It's not like I'm going to be completely redesigning this area at one point, probably. Uh, but whatever. Why can't I put trees there? What in the world? I don't know. But, uh, yeah, so we finished the Lunar, Lunar Licensing Program this episode. So, yeah, uh, thank you for watching. And, uh, you know, next episode we're probably going to be starting the other temperate sector that we got. So...
yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. Like, subscribe, comment, do all the fun things. And see you guys in the next episode. Alright, thank you. Peace.